Well, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, Hidden Dragon Pie brings to you Blue Eyes Synchro Deck Profile. Don't forget to like and subscribe buttons down below. Let me know what you think of my deck, and I'll get started. Again, this is more of a for fun build, so we got uh, three maidens. When she's targeted by spell, special summon Blue Eyes from hand, deck, or grave. When she's attacked, switch to defense, negate the attack. Special summon Blue Eyes from hand, deck, or field, uh, grave. Obviously, if you're going to do that, you need three blue eyes. Uh, one red eyes darkness metal, special summons. Uh, only two white stone of legends. I find three gets to be too cloggy. Uh, two effect veilers. They're good for uh, synchros as well as the other targets, plus their effect veilers. Two junk synchrons. Uh, special summon one from the grave with level two or below so that helps with some of the synchros as well as bringing back maiden from the grave so it helps with recycling her two doppel warriors special summon from the can be special summon from the graveyard or hand when you special summon a monster from the graveyard plus it's also searchable with rota uh two rise bells goes along with part of the otk target maiden maiden summons blue eyes uh, Synchro, Maiden, and Rise Bell for Ancient Sacred Wyvern. Tag for game. Uh, two new tech in choices for the deck. Bright Star Dragon. Great card. Uh, when this card is normal summon, target one face-up monster. Except this card, increase its level by two until the end of the phase. So you target your Maiden. Maiden summons out Blue Eyes. And you can either Synchro for Ancient Sacred again with this guy. Or you can stay grow for summon for Star Eater. So it's really great for that. Uh, one Photon Thrasher. As long as you control no monsters, special summon it. And if you control another monster, it can't attack. So you summon this, special summon, or special summon this, normal summon, and then go right along. Uh, one Chaos Sorcerer. So you, since you uh, do run enough lights and darks, you can uh, run one of them. Uh, one Gorse to help prevent OTKs. And one BLS as well to stop, to run over anything, get rid of any problematic cards, things like that. Uh, for spells, three MSTs, get rid of back row. Two emergency teleports for your uh, rise bell play. Also, it can help prevent from being OTK at that point as well. Two wonder ones uh, to target either maiden or effect veiler. Or any other spellcaster gains 500 attack. Send this and that monster to the graveyard. Draw two cards. So it's really great for draw power as well as bringing out blue eyes and other things. Uh, one silent doom to help keep your blue eyes on the field. Rota to search for your warriors. Uh, just the one cards of consonants for a little added draw power. Same with the one trade in. Uh, and one for one to help bring out either Maiden or anything like that. Does it for spells. Traps, very small. One bottomless, two D prison, two mirror force. Like I said, that's pretty much my standard five traps for every deck. Uh, this extra deck, this is based on personal choice. I like uh, TG Hyper Librarian since it's a more synchro based deck for drawing. Uh, Magical Android gain five, gain 600 life points for each psychic monster, so that's really good for uh, plus getting up for gaining life points. It's 2400 attacker. Uh, one Arcanite Magician. Uh, pop two cards on the field. It's not vulnerable to bottomless, so it's really good for that. Uh, Ancient Sacred Wyvern I've talked about plenty of times. Stardust we all know. Stardust Spark Dragon. Scrap Dragon, Crimson Blader. The proxy card is for Beazle, King of Dragons, when it comes out in the TCG. Uh, it's a level 8 tuner, uh, Synchro Monster, 3000 attack, 3000 defense. Uh, it cannot be destroyed by battle or by card effects. And whenever you take damage from a battle involving this card and an opponent's card or from a card effect, that card gains attack equal to the amount of damage taken. So it can become a real nuisance like Star Eater. Uh, one Azurai Silver Dragon. When this card is Synchro Summoned, protects all dragons currently on the field till your next turn. And one Star Eater. We all know what that does. 
Uh, for the XCs, they're all rank 8s. So you got Felgran, Heretic Sun Dragon Lord of Heliopolis, and two Thunder End Dragons to clear out the field. Alrighty, so that is my Blue Eyes Synchro based deck profile. Don't forget the like and subscribe buttons down below. Let me know what you think of my Blue Eyes deck. And this is Hidden Dragon, signing out.